Hi y'all, how are ya? So, we're looking at a really weird looking green mat. That's okay. So I added a third video card into my computer, and that's the uh, 770, the ACX version. It's got dual fans on it. And, um... So if you watch my last Thief video, you'll notice I mentioned in that video I was running in 2 sly SLI with the third card as a dedicated Phys X. And that was great, I was getting awesome performance across everything. But after that video, I switched over to just full three-way sly, and that gave me another 20 frames per second. And so now, playing Thief, I'm between, you know, generally 170 frames a second, it drops down to the 150s. Might get down into the 130s in some really intense areas. Uh, all the games are now running like 100 plus frames a second, uh, except for Assassin's Creed Black Flag. That's in the 70s, up to the 80s occasionally, but as we know, that's a pretty uh, crazy game for performance. Uh, Battlefield 3 is running over 100, usually around 103 to 110. It uh, doesn't really drop up below 100. Uh, what else have I tried? Grid 2, yeah, 120 frames a second. Everything is running absolutely phenomenal at uh, three-way SLI with uh, three GTX 770s. But it did introduce a new problem, and I was expecting it. I just didn't know how bad it was going to be, but it's bad, let me tell you. So when you have the three video cards in SLI mode, there's only like a millimeter or one 1.5 maybe millimeter gap between the two cards. And uh, so the new card is on the bottom. Uh, with a two fat with a dual fan ACX cooler, and so that one's running fairly nice. It runs in the mid 60s for temperature. The top card, uh, which is just running the regular uh, GTX 770, these are all super clock editions, but it's the regular cooling unit, so it's not getting any air, but it, and it's running in the uh, high 70s, low 80s. But the middle card is just getting baked. It's hitting 90, 91, 92 even degrees Celsius. Yeah, it's getting baked. So I need to solve that problem. So what I did is I went out and I got myself uh, some liquid cooling systems. This is the Arctic Accelero Hybrid 2 uh, liquid cooling system. So that'll go on there and that'll cool the middle card. And, uh, well, that one will cool the top card. The bottom card is fine. I don't need to add extra cooling to that, but I do for the other ones. They're just going to get baked up there. So I've got the two liquid cooling systems. I'm going to have to figure out how to actually get them installed. Um, I think I know I know where I can put the one fan, and that's on the regular rear exhaust. Um, and the other one I'm not sure. So let's just do a quick unboxing and see what, uh, what we got here. Okay, so this is uh, an additional bracket. Yep. Um, some manual stuff. Yeah, so this bracket um, gives you extra mounting support. Uh, okay, so there is uh, the fan that it comes with. Um, as well as it looks like maybe, come on, this might be the back plate that it comes with, which I'll use on the top card, but I won't be able to use on the middle card because it, I just don't think it has the, uh, the space for it. So yeah, there's the, uh, the back plate cooling system. Sorry, I'm only doing this with one hand. I don't have a cameraman. I'm not Linus. So there's the uh, back plate cooling system. Uh, that'll work on the one card. Uh, it comes with some compound. That's good. Let's put some compound on there. Uh, are these all of the extra? I don't know what the hell that is. Some sort of a pad. Looks like it comes with a bunch of additional heat sinks. No, it doesn't. Yes, it does. Oh, it does too. I wasn't sure if it did, and I'm so glad it does actually. Yeah. No, actually, it doesn't come with the additional heat sinks. Those are just spacers. And then here is the cooling pump itself and everything. Look at that. And there's the radiator. So there's the radiator. Yes, this is my hobby desk sort of in mid changeover mode and there's the radiator look at that thing that thing's pretty big and there's the cooler so there we go an unboxing of the hydro system um, I'll get some more video later on of it all up and running and of course I got the second one alright I'll see you later bye